somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit. Think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. this to Kanja for Duck. A clipboard. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. allergic to bees. Is that right? That's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't. But you're probably right. How's that? I don't know. Tired. Which could mean a lot of things, right? Yeah. His body's probably fighting whatever's in it. Exactly. Would you have left Lily back there? On the side of the road like that? Yes, Lee. Yeah? We have to have lines. Yes, I would have left her. Okay, then. Has Clementine said anything to you about Doug or Duck or anything? I'm worried about it. No. That little girl is a puzzle. Yeah, she is. Poor dog. God, where did yesterday go? I don't know. You were standing right there. Are you doing okay? I'm used to it by now. We all are, aren't we? She murdered him, Lee. I was there, Kat. I'm sorry. I liked him very much. He'd spent some time in Belgium. Where your family's from? Yes. Even further away now. Anyway, let me know if anything changes here. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. Hey man, we're still looking around and 
haven't figured much out yet. It's fine. Radiator could use a rest as it is. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay then. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. Might be something inside. That'll crack a scroll just fine. Might be something inside. Switch. Nothing. Might be something inside. Shit. We got one. Walker, sitting in the chair. We got him. Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that one. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. That's Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. Maybe it goes somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. It's a bunch of papers. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Ooh. We got a problem. What? We still got the rest of the train attached to us back there. Shit. I tried to yank the pin out, but it won't budge. Well, we ain't going anywhere until it does. No 
idea what to do with these. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kinda see the indentations from the writing. Definitely pry this thing free, if I can break it loose first. It's stuck. We need a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. a bunch of force to break away all this rust and whatnot before I can pry anything free. There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? No, I wish. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Well, if you're not using it, I'd take it. I'm out of paper, and there's all sorts of new leaves around here. We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it. But the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out.
pencil. Sharpened, too. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, so good. Now we're talking. We're golden! What about Duck? What about it? Look, Kitty, it's something we're gonna have to deal with. Did you not hear, Cat? We don't know shit, Lee. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mom, let's see if she'll move. It's all yours. Attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? Get us unstuck? Yeah. Hey, Kenny, we're loose! You touch any of my stuff? Got them all right up here. Now 
guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. Yeah. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. <coughs> I'm awful sorry your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on the... Stay with us. We'd like the company. Hey, sweet pea. That candy Chuck gave you. It taste okay? It was really good. No funny aftertaste? No. Train's cool, huh? I guess. Scary, kind of. Hey, Chuck. Honey. Where are you from? You live around here? Georgia boy. You saw where I live. Why are you alone? Why not? Seem to be doing all right. Fine, then. I'm sorry. I do like being around y'all, actually. It's nice. You caught us on a bad day. Mm. You still got a couple of kids. And this one's got a good spirit. That's some kind of something. I'll talk to you later. Hope so. I better get back to it. How you doing, Ben? I'm watching the girls and not working on a mega cool train. What do you think? So that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, so just gather whatever you have. Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can't ignore this. Look at the kid, Kenny. This is happening. Ain't shit happening. And if it were, what can we do here? We get on the train and we find something better. That is the plan. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense until we get where we're going.
Gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. There were more of us. Dad, get them? No. Ah, living got them. Lee. Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What, sir? If you get that off his face, my hands are full here. Thank you. Could you just get that off his face, please? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. Stop the train. Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. You're acting like nothing's wrong. And somebody's got to knock some sense into you. I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. Don't give a fuck that we don't get along. I'm not letting you do this to Cat and Duck! You wanna hurt people because you're afraid! Losing Duck ain't enough for you! Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this! I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen! Always been bit, in case you haven't figured that out. Take as long as you need. There ain't no time left to take. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But what if what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you to hear me. What you are saying, that he may not do, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cap. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. Right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know. But we know it's here or nothing. Fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. 
I'll do it. No, you don't have to. Gotcha. Fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. I'll do it. No, it should be a parent. No parent should have to do something like this. Lee's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. Take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! She could. She, 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 she just. Oh, 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 fuck!
Hey, how you doing? Say it to me, asshole, what you said to my girl. Excuse me, son. Telling the little girl she's gonna die. What a scare people scare me. The fucker. Okie dokie. She's gonna die. Son of a bitch. How is that? How about I throw your sorry ass off this fucking train? Now we're both scared. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. That y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I'll tell you, as long as you don't toss me over the rail. I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? I figure it out. Well, get to figuring, because it'll be on top of us before you know it. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. She's a little girl. And she'll die a little girl if you treat her like one. You gotta consider her a living person. That's it. You're either living or you're not. You ain't little, you ain't a girl, you ain't a boy. You ain't strong or smart. You're alive. Look at her hair. You got her running around with a mop that's gonna act like Velcro to any hand swinging its way. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before Walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job, but too many people have died already. They have. And seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It's something. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. We got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there about whether or not you folks want company. You have any family? Out there, somewhere. Been sort of on my own for the past, oh, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. You're homeless then. Eh, suppose. I've had homes here and there, and, and they just don't work out. I like a drink, you know? Yeah. Got any? No. Darn. Be safe up here. You betcha. Full of maps and documents. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? Hey. Hey. It'll be good to get to the water. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure Cat would be uh, okay with you. So forget it. Okay. Hey. Yeah? You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Can. It's the best plan. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Get out of here. Hey, Ben. Hey. Aren't many of us left? Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. 
Clementine. The homeless dude if he sticks around. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. Doug saved your life, you know. I know, I know. I don't know if I can go on like this, man. Well, you're gonna. That's just the way it is. See you. Yeah. Looks like Chuck has some booze left. It's a fifth of whiskey. I hope we're not on this train much longer. Hey, Clint. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look. I'm not gonna let anything bad happen to you, but there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay. Well, what should we do? Well, we're gonna figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and, uh, tidy up a little, so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. What do you think about Chuck? I don't know. Me neither. He might be an okay guy, though. You think? We'll keep an open mind about him. He's probably had it pretty rough. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath. Right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, I was a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. Okay. Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. You okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Close. Now keep it steady. Okay, a little higher. Okay, aim a little bit more to the left. A little higher. Steady now. Almost got it. Okay, a little higher. Close. Now keep it steady. Close. Now keep it steady. Steady now. Almost got it. Aim lower. I got it! Excellent. Good shot. A little bit more to the left. A little bit lower. There you go. Nice. 